I was depressed with no motivation for anything and suicidal. Those such as Samaya Kalnan say talking about thoughts of suicide here at Ohio's Central Clinic Behavioral Health actually helps when you want to turn those thoughts around. Her advice now? Find someone that you can really talk to. Dr. Tracy Cummings says if you are the person someone chooses to talk to when they're considering taking their own life, ask them if they have a plan. It's the only way to interrupt it. If you have a concern about someone's safety, directly asking them in that fashion, you know, I'm worried about how things are going. I'm wondering if you're feeling safe. Those are okay things to ask. You know, someone may verbalize feeling hopelessness. Uh, they may feel trapped or a burden to others. And those are real warning signs uh, that someone may not be safe. Other warning signs, according to the National Institutes of Health, include a person talking about wanting to die. If they tell you that they've been researching this, here is what you need to know. If you're someone who's with a person who may not be safe, sitting with them and removing access to lethal, lethal means is very important. Uh, and for those of us at society at large, working to reduce the stigma for those seeking help with mental health concerns. Now, we also do want to remind you that 988 can be a great resource for you to call or text 24-7 in English or Spanish to help save a life. Counselors say remember to check in on those you are worried about. Let them know you're a safe person to help them find help. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Back to you. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.